Got a question from Josh in regards to car setup. The difference between a qualifying car and a race car, is it much? Do we change the car a lot when we get to the race? The truth is a qualifying car is usually quite an edgy car, quite a tailor car. And in a race, you want something that's a little more user friendly so it's not potentially as loose. So we do change the car a lot. We put a lot into the setup. And at a race like Bathurst, we chase the setup during the day. So tire pressures, clicks on the shock absorber to make it a little bit stiffer, a little bit harder, anti-roll bar adjusters inside the car. We adjust all these things as the day temperature increases and decreases, and as the surface may change, amount of rubber that goes down the circuit, all these things contribute during the day to changing the car, and, um, and we chase it pretty hard. Nathan asks, what sort of things will be changing on Saturday night in the lead into the race for Sunday? Because back in the day, we used to change everything. Engine, gearbox, clutch, diff, uprights, radiator, you name it, they used to pull it out and put a new one in. It's not that bad anymore. We certainly pull everything off the car, measure it, check it, but a lot of the stuff we put back on, we'll run the same uprights, we'll run the same tail shaft, we'll run the same engine for the, for the weekend we'll keep the radiator the same. A lot of these things will just be check and replace. We'll put a new transaxle in the car, we'll check a few other things, but pretty much it's just about measure, adjust and check.